Hey guys, I'm LB, and let's check out Philosophy by Paper. I don't know, man. That's- that's all the description says, is IDK, man. And all lowercase. Uh, okay then. <laughs> so much for the description, I suppose. Let's just jump into it, and see what the philosophy of this map is. Well, we've got the- we've got the faceplate music, so that's nice. Good old friendly faceplate. We have a cube that auto-drops, but it also has a button to respawn it. We have some ant lines crossing, but, uh, not too big a deal. Oh, come on! You could've easily put an ant line blocker on that side, and made the ant line go on this side instead. Come on, that's just lazy. <laughs> oh dear. Last time we had something like that, it was a Zillius map. So, what does this button do, aside from that dropper? Oh, just- just that dropper. Alright, let's- let's put this back here for now, then. Seems we can't really do much in there. Huh. What does square go to? Oh, that's... not at all what I expected. Okay, uh... Well, how about we do this instead? Alright. Now we have a laser, I suppose? Mm hmm Oh, that's a companion cube. Neat. What do I need to do with this, actually? I don't think I actually have a reason to do this just yet. That requires a laser. Huh. How am I supposed to get around this laser wall? I need to get up here somehow, don't I? There's a fizzler there, though. Interesting. Very interesting. Let's get this cube back, why don't we? Yep, that- that just respawns that cube. I'm not sure why I would want that, to be honest. I'm really not sure. Huh. How am I meant to get up here? I don't- I don't- I'm not clear on the concept. I can't just walk through here. Yeah, this is- this is not a good idea. <laughs> At least we can see some of the stuff here. There's like a- well, there's even a little wall there. That's not what I expected. Do I just want to get something on that button that has no signage? Oh no, it does have signage. Oh, it- it goes to- no, it goes to the Fizzler. Okay, well then... what? Um... I mean, I guess I'll try it. <laughs> Just, uh... Let's see if we can get this to work at all, in any capacity. Yeah, that doesn't really do much for me now, does it? Oh! I can go through here now. Aha! That's not at all what I expected. Right. Well, now what? Uh... You know, you could've just put this glass on this tile, and then extended the fizzler, so that I wouldn't be able to shoot a portal like- like there. Although it's not- not that big a deal, to be honest. <laughs> so never mind, I'm just being pedantic. Huh. Yeah, cause I can easily just shoot a portal from here. <laughs> Why do I even care? That is a very specifically strange height, isn't it? Alright, 
almost feel like... Almost. No, 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 I want this to go at the top. And... I can't put it at the top. Fine. <laughs> How does that... Like, does that... does that laser go above or below here? I'm not entirely sure. I seem to have the right idea, though, but what do I put the laser cube on if... N yeah, because we need... S the companion cube needs to be activated. How do we activate the companion cube? How do we activate the companion cube? Oh, we need the laser to point there. All right. Okay. Let's go ahead and save here. You never know. Alright, there's that much. There's multiple ways to get this laser cube out, that's just one of the ways. Right, now what? We need to... I think we need to do something like this, right? Oh, actually I can just do that from... Yeah, okay. I see. I see! bit by bit. Get out of here. Does it auto-respawn? Yes, it does! Excellent! So, let's go ahead and respawn the regular cube. And we can use this method to obtain the companion cube. Then what's the best way to actually get the companion cube over there, huh? Hmm. Do we even want the companion cube over there? Does it even matter which cube we use? It might not. Yeah, maybe we could just leave the regular cube over there. Yeah, sure. Yeah, why not? Look at that. Doing my work for me. Right, so now that's... taken care of. We need to do... We need to do the whole rigmarole with, uh... Yeah, with this. Set this up. Get this out of the way. There's that. Whoops. There we go. Excellent. Right, now we just need both cubes in here. Yeah, it should be pretty straightforward, shouldn't it? Let's save at this position, and I think we can just do this. Excellent. Take this through the portal. There we go. And... I guess put it here. Yeah, that's where it needs to be. Ta-da! And we even get to take the companion cube to the exit. Good old floating laser cube glitch. Alright. Well guys, as always, thank you so much for watching, I really appreciate it, and I'll see you all in another video. Goodbye!